One of the most important steps that people don't know about while preparing a plane before takeoff is a pre-flight checklist. In today's video, we talk about what are pre-flight checklists and their importance. A pre-flight checklist is exactly what would come to your mind. It's a handbook that a pilot and crew would carry around, containing all the items and tasks that they must accomplish before the flight. Each aircraft will have a different checklist. Those checklists will be provided by the plane's manufacturer and they're designed to help the pilots ensure that the aircraft is working properly and that it is safe for travel. Looking at the complexity of the aircraft controls and instruments, pilots would check multiple factors before even taxing on the ground. After all, it is easier to address a problem on ground than in air, and it is the last opportunity that the pilot has to identify any problem before riding on a disastrous flight. The idea behind checklists came from the fatal accident that took place in 1935. The cause of the accident was that the crew forgot the gust lock, which resulted in the plane crashing just after takeoff. After the incident, Boeing, the manufacturer of the plane, realized that it's not easy to operate a plane just for memory alone. So they implemented the idea of checklists, and soon the aviation industry started practicing it as well. Before any flight, the pilot and crew members will prepare the plane together for the flight. The first step that the pilot takes is the pre-flight briefing. The pilot will go to the airport few hours before the flight to conduct the briefing with the crew members. In this stage, several things will be discussed, like the amount of fuel needed for the trip will be calculated, weather predictions, backup plans for emergencies and flight analysis. This step gives the perfect opportunity for everyone to be on the same page and avoid unnecessary mistakes. Some of the checks that are physically done by the pilot is daily inspection and turnaround checks. During the daily inspections, the plane will be inspected physically in depth. The pilot would do this check in the start of the day. Pilots will go around the aircraft and will check for any broken parts, structural cracks, leaks, and any mechanism concern. Turnaround checks usually is less extensive than daily inspections. Because it happens between flights, the pilot will check for any loose cowls, low tire pressure, and chafing wires. Avionics and Aircraft Setups During this stage, the pilot will go over the controls of the aircraft, checking things like radios, hydraulic system, fuel system, electrical system, etc. Safety System Check After performing all the checks on the aircraft, the pilot will test the aircraft and check if everything's working smoothly. If not, the aircraft will be kept on standby until the problem is solved. Just like how pilots perform multiple checks on the plane before the flight, the flight attendants will have multiple tasks as well that are essential for an efficient and safe flight. Some of the checks that take place is Security Checks This is the first thing that the crew will do when they board on the plane. They will have a walk through the cabin and check if all areas are secure and safe and that nothing has been left behind. Something that could be kept in the lost property or things that might be of a threat to safety. They check seat pockets, under the seats, etc. They will also look if anything is missing in the cabin like seatbelts or life jackets. Surprisingly, those items can be stolen sometimes. Safety Checks In this check stage, the crew will check if the evacuation alarm, passengers' address systems, and emergency lights are working perfectly. Some airlines will require the cabin crew to use the pressure gauge on the door to make sure that the door shut during the flights. Safety Equipment In this stage, the firefighting equipment will be checked. It will include fire extinguishers, protective breathing equipment, fire gloves, etc. All the cabin crew members are familiar with the places of the safety equipment. Each member will have a life jacket and a torch close to their seat just in case of any emergency. A checklist might seem an unnecessary step to many people, but it is always good to double check and avoid unnecessary mistakes. Many aircraft accidents could have been avoided if the pre-flight checklists were done properly. This is the end of today's video. How important do you think pre-flight checklists are? Let us know in the comments section below. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and turn the post notifications on to receive the latest from Tiddynope. See you in the next one.